Hi, I'm Janet LaFleur from the Flash Array product marketing team here with a special product announcement. We're now shipping a direct compress accelerator inside every Flash Array XL. This PCIe card offloads the inline compression step from the Flash Array CPU and delivers deep compression rates from the moment data is ingested. That means that you can stretch your storage capacity and your storage dollar even further. Today, we've got VJ from the Platform Product Management Team to tell you all about it and what this extreme efficiency can mean for you and your business. Hi everyone, my name is Vijay Ramakrishnan. I'm a senior product manager in the Platform Business Unit. I'm responsible for the Flash Array X and Excel product lines. I'm gonna be talking to you today about the new Direct Compress Accelerator, which is a hardware accelerator for our Flash Array portfolio. Some of the salient features of this uh, Direct Compress Accelerator are that we'll offload the inline compression from the system CPU to a dedicated FPGA card. And then as a result of this, we'll be able to accomplish deep compression even when the system is under heavy, heavy load. And we'll also be incorporating a new algorithm that improves compression in line by up to 30%. Now I'll be first talking to you about the current state of compression on our flash arrays, and then talk to you about the benefits that the direct compress accelerator delivers. So today we do compression in a two-step process. There is an inline compression, which means compression done before the data is written to the storage media. And then deep compression is done opportunistically, which means when the system CPU has free cycles, there is a deeper compression that is done. So the significant thing to note here is that when our compression algorithm is actually based on how we see uh, customer workloads are done, and then we always have a machine learning algorithm that is that auto adjusts how, which algorithm needs to be used for compressing a specific type of data because we train our, our algorithm based on customer workloads and it is able to auto detect which algorithm to pick based on the machine learning that is done. And we also have implemented uh, variable block sizes in our uh, flash array compression algorithm compared to many of our co customers who are restricted to use a fixed block size. And then here, uh, the key challenge in the current process is that when the system is under heavy system, heavy load, the, the deep compression is compromised to some extent. Now we solve that by introducing this new direct compress accelerator. So we would ideally like to have deep compression as an always on process so that all the data that is ingested is always deep compressed. But to implement this in software, there is a large power tax. But this is overcome when we have a dedicated FPGA to accomplish this. And now we'll talk about some of the benefits of using a dedicated FPGA card to do the inline compression. So first off, all the data that is ingested always passes through the direct compress accelerator. And then we are also enhancing the algorithm that is used for inline compression and it delivers 30% higher performance compared to before. And then finally, we are gonna retain the opportunistic compression that is done when the data is already written to the direct flash medium. So this means first we do a deep compression, follow it up with an even deeper compression opportunistically. And then finally, the key benefit here is that because deep compression is always done by default, it means that even when the system is under heavy load, there is no compromise on deep compression. And this is particularly important for high capacity, high performance systems, such as the Flash Array Excel. Thank you so much. We are really excited to bring you this new and exciting technology. Thanks, Vijay. That's all for today's update. To get more details, read the Direct Compress Accelerator technical blog, and you can also check out our Purity Release Highlights page, where you'll find links to more blogs, videos, release notes, and other information, plus information about all the Purity 6.4 releases. Thank you, and see you again soon with our next Flash Array announcement.